morning, beautiful people. I hope all of you all are doing well. This is the day that the Lord has made and we shall rejoice and be glad in it. We are on our way to church. We are on our way to the Lord's house. Yes. Oh, is that a blue jay? Oh my goodness, we gotta look that up. <clears throat> what the meaning, the significance behind uh, behind it when you see a blue jay. We gotta look that up. We are almost through, guys, with 2022. We're almost through. Do not forget, if you have not watched that video, do not forget to finish this year strong. If it is accomplishing that goal, then great. But do not beat yourself up if you did not accomplish certain things that you set out to accomplish this year before this year ends. Do not put that pressure on yourself. Do not. Because you still have time. You still have time. So just know that. It's a little cold. Let me turn a little. Let me turn this heat up just a smidgen. Just a smidgen, guys. Just a smidgen. Doggone. I can get it. You can get it? Okay. Let me slow down in my spirit because I feel rushed in my spirit. And that's the worst feeling ever is to feel rushed in your spirit. Because things just begin to go haywire and then you become frustrated and all of that. And that ain't nothing but the trick of the enemy. So I refuse to be heading on on heading to the Lord's house frustrated. No. No, 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 no. Got it. Okay. No weapon that's formed against me shall prosper. I shall and will rejoice in this day. So we're not going to play them games, say. You is under my feet where you shall remain. So we've been doing good. We have... Um, I want to say this is our third time going to church consecutively this is our third time um, going to church so we've been we've been going gradually inching our way back in there um, of course you know when it comes to our church and to be honest with you since the pandemic any church you can just simply just watch online and so that's one of the good things about our church is that we, we can watch it online if we choose to but there is something there's there's something about being in the atmosphere in the environment right there in church you know it's just it's just something about being there that makes a world of a difference so we pushing our way in we're gonna have church and then um i'm gonna take you all along with me i am not purchasing a townhouse but this particular builder, I absolutely love their homes and their townhomes. And so today they are having a grand opening. And so I'm going to take you all along with me as we tour their three plans that they have and also enjoy the festivities that they have lined up. So I will definitely be bringing you all along the way that and I may bring you all into church service as well we'll see we shall see but in the meantime we're gonna say toodles
Hey there, beautiful people. I hope all is well. Church is over. And huh, when I tell you, pastor preached a word. He preached from 1 Corinthians. The child, I don't forget. Let me see. The title of the sermon was I Got the Victory, but he preached from 1 Corinthians. Child, I forgot the chapter, honey. I ain't got my book with me. I'll tell y'all later. But it was a good word. He preached, he preached from 1 Corinthians and 2 Kings. But I can't remember the chapter. One minute. I think it's 1 Corinthians, and I'll tell y'all later. But I think it's 1 Corinthians chapter 15, verse 54 through 58. And then 2 Kings It'd be on the screen. It was so, so good. So, so good. So, so good. So now I'm taking off my shoes because I'm about to put on my, take off my heels. I had a splash of red on my lips. Splash of red pumps. For church. And now I'm about to throw on, I'm about to take this top off put on my jacket too bad I didn't do an outfit of the day I got so many compliments in church today about my outfit young girls older women coming to me like yes you did that today and I did so I'm sorry I'm eating and so I truly appreciated the compliments. Ladies, let me tell y'all something. If you see somebody out there banging the beats, go ahead and compliment them. You never know what a person is going through. And that compliment could have very well just hit the reset button in their life. They've been discouraged. They've been dealing with insecurities. Battling comparison, feeling unworthy, but because you told them that they're beautiful, that changed their mind about everything. All it takes is to pay a compliment, don't cost you a thing, don't cost you a thing. So, remember that, remember that, and also be kind. I was reading First Peter. Um, help me, Lord. First Peter, chapter three, verse eight. It'll be on the screen. But basically what the scripture was saying is that we are to treat, we are to love one another. We are to treat each other as if they are a brethren in our own household. So, in other words, you treat people like they're family. Be kind. Be courteous. Um, you know, be gentle. Have some sympathy towards people and their situations. And um, and that just really helped me put some things into perspective. We are to love one another and treat each other accordingly. So, there you have it. So, here come my family. Mm. Hey, baby, how was it? Good. What you learned today? We learned about God's plans. Mm. I'm sorry. It's so good. <laughs> Let's go to the Hey, Poopy, put, put this back in the armrest. Well, actually put that underneath my jacket. I'm about to, I'm about to put it on. Okay.
Oh, she's going to see a park. I'm about to go over here to, um, to Farmington. What's that? Well, you'll find out when you get there. Oh, my goodness, it's good. Did you talk to the other kids? Mm hmm It wasn't a lot of you all in there, was it? Okay, I had to make sure you found metal. After you left, it was. Yeah. Uh, who? You. Oh. Yeah, I had to come out to the car, honey. Them shoes is cute. But not on that, not on that concrete um floor right now. Mm-mm. Let me see. Let me see that back. <laughs> hey Fat Fat. Did did they feed you um canines in there? Mm-hmm. Did you eat it? Mm -hmm. Okay, I hope so. They could have fed us. Mom, we're going to a food truck. You know what? This lady told me she liked my hair. I signed up to volunteer. Let's hope this food truck free. I doubt it. You know, I'm kind of glad the pastor um canceled the um the uh, night watch service. Why? You don't want to be in there. Not that late coming through Charlotte. No. Like we ain't never been. We've been living here for. No, I'm. I'm not. I'm just saying. I ain't acting like. I'm just saying. I don't. I don't want to have to be out that late coming through Charlotte. Not anymore. But I'm gonna go to Valentine for the uh for the night for the night serve the uh the night of worship. I'm gonna go to Valentine. I'm gonna be there bright live in person, huh? So we're gonna have to um. Well, I'm going to Valentine. I'm gonna be right there in it. Only because. See, it's more, it's smaller. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it might be less people here. That's true. I just don't want to. Hey, we don't ever have to fight to get out of the parking lot. That's true. Yeah, that's true. We'd be there for a while. All you see is red lights because everybody's sitting with their brakes up. <laughs> mm hmm. And it's a ways away from the house, so, yeah. Mm. <laughs> that fruit was everything. Give me a paper towel back to baby. Thank you. Um, that food was everything, honey. Throw these Nikes on. Yep. This lady told me she liked my hair and that I inspired her to do her hair. My mom told me she liked my makeup, and all I did was my eyebrows. <laughs> <laughs> you put some powder on your face. Mm -mm. Just my eyebrows, and I put on mascara. Oh, well, so that like... means me washing my face is, is, is helping my skin. Yeah, I guess so. Cause it looked like I thought you had some powder on. <laughs> I ain't get to finish using the restroom in peace, so I might have to go to this hotel before I go over there to um. Yeah, I'm going to have to go around here today. Well, Man, what happened that you couldn't finish using the bathroom? There was too much going on in there. I couldn't use it in peace. And plus, I had way too much clothes on. This what right here. Did fart or something? No. <laughs> <laughs> then plus, I got this on. This was long. And so, I'm having to hold this to make sure you don't fall in the toilet and all kinds of stuff. So, it was just too much trying to... Trying to... When you go to the hotel. I can't believe y'all be wearing y'all tennis shoes with no socks on. I don't like wearing socks on. I don't like socks. I don't like socks. I can't put my shoes in no ten my feet in no tennis shoes with no socks. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I love wearing tennis shoes with no socks. Huh? Are y'all the same? Do y'all wear socks with y'all tennis shoes? Because I love wearing my tennis shoes with no socks. I do not like socks, so I don't put socks on often. Like or subscribe with socks. Don't talk to food in your mouth. What are you eating? <laughs> <laughs> what are you eating? What they feed y'all? Why did they wait so late to feed them? Because um, they're meant to stay for the next service. Look houses for the kids that stand for two services. So that's why they feed them now and then they, you know, they leave at the end of the 1130. Mom's changing. Let me just put my shoes. 
shacking on. Oh. Call it shacking? Yeah, I don't nobody call that, honey. It just just be a straight up jacket. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Cause what's these shirts called? I guess we call it a flannel. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure what it called. Oh, maybe okay. it, they call it a shacky because it looked like a shirt. Like a subscribe if you wear so a shirt socks jacket. and tennis shoes. Cause I know I do. <laughs> but she don't. Mm -mm. How can you shirt wear tennis shoes? Um, let me see. What time is it? It's time for me. I just want to know how, you, how your hair managed to look like that. We were running around. I know you was. I know you was. <laughs> she probably was running, running tumbling. You know I was tumbling, was. actually. I was. Yeah, your hair don't never look the same unless it's braided mm -hmm. up. <laughs> Which will never happen until like next year. Well, next year is next month. Oh. I already had everything. I got great kids. I'm on Boo, Ellie. Mm. One bread. I did not realize my pants was this ripped. I ain't trying to be funny when I say this, but I liked the praise team last week. Oh my gosh, mom. I literally, it's something about that girl. She's throwing everybody off. She, she do too much. She was throwing me off. I had, to, I had to really tell myself, and I'm so sorry, you guys, but this is the truth. Sometimes you just got to be honest and, and, just, and just tell the truth. I I had to get to the point that I had to stop focusing. I had to stop looking at her because she was she 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 was taking she she was just dis, she was a distraction. She was just a pure distraction. And another thing is, I don't know what y'all be saying. And another thing is, um, another thing she needs to stop all that screaming and sing. She be singing. She's trying to sing like that girl. That she is. She's trying. She's trying to be like the one at Ella, at, the, at the main campus. Yeah, that's not her real voice, and so they just be confusing me because she be she either be singing too slow or she sings too fast, and then it throws everybody off on stage. And they like, then she be doing too much, bless her heart. She just she just doing that. Just could be really her. That just I don't be, see none of that. I'm glad you don't because this I, is I be, distraction I be for me. I'm praising the Lord. I, I be trying. I be praising the Lord too, but then when I look over there, I just I just I just start thinking some stuff. <laughs> I just be like, Lord, let me stop looking over there because. Sometimes mom every sings quietly and sometimes she do. I guess it depends on how she, how much she feel in the song. <laughs> <laughs> it does depend. Because <laughs> mm -hmm. I really like it. I'm going to sing it. A shirt, TT. I hope they got a good food truck. Well, that's it. We're going to find out. So let's head that way. Well, first, I need to go around here to the hotel, honey. I got to use this bathroom. I kid you not. Do you know where we're going? Nope, Do you need... oh, okay. <laughs> First, I'm going to hit this hotel. I know where exactly it is, but I don't know how to get there. Well, they said that the um, the the Charlotte Observer um, ranked them number one food truck in the city of Charlotte, so they got to be good. What's it? You know the name of it, or you, they just said that? You want yeah, they have put the name on there on the site. I don't know. I don't remember the exact name, but it's it's on their site. Where you parked it, T? She parked down there. I saw her car when we came up in the front on this row. Oh, see, the, the 1130 service is so, nobody's in here. It probably be packed when me and T.T. was coming by ourselves. Yes. It used to be very packed. Yeah, we're going to Harrisburg, but I'm going to go around here to the hotel first. Okay, come on. Come on. Nah, TT, why not you still trying to get yourself together? Oh, where am I running over? Oh, you got this stuck. You probably don't run over a cone. I don't run over a cone. <laughs> come on, man, I come. Look at the parking attendant. <laughs> Church, really. oh. I didn't even see the call. I said, 
Is it not that good? But well, let me pull up. Maybe if I pull up. Let's see if you can see if you can back up. Okay, let's see. Try to back up. Oh my goodness. Reagan, are y'all not embarrassed? Mom, she's being in the phone and do you know, huh? Where's it at? Keep going. Keep going. Keep coming out? Keep going. That is a shame. Lord help us. <laughs> okay. Oh my gosh, I didn't even see the thing. Yeah, she got on the camera. <laughs> uh oh. I'm trying to see myself in Tiki's camera. I didn't even see the cone. All I know is I heard that crumbly, 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 crumbly cone. That is such a shame. I wasn't embarrassed. People run over all the time. That's what I'm myself They run over them all the time. So I'm gonna to go to this hotel first, use the bathroom, and then we'll head over. This thing was stuck up underneath the car. That is a shame. Oh my god! Oh, they all on this side. That's why. You know, this is the main parking lot. Yeah, that's why I was thinking wasn't nobody at 11:30 service. They all on this side. See, we stopped parking on this side. you guys well I, we had a really good time being here but I will say I did not get much footage that I would that I that I wanted to get only because it was a lot of people that um, is here for the grand opening for this particular community so I may have to come back at a later time and um, uh-oh, hold on. I can't, I can't even see how much space I got to pull out because this thing is so dumb. Uh, yeah, because this thing's so sensitive. Two more minutes. Stop. Okay. Cut it hard. <laughs> you said cut it hard. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. I got it. <laughs> Perfect. Perfect. Thank you, Mike. I will see you at the Arbors when they come open. Okay, roger that. Bye. <laughs> Um, so yeah, because it was a lot of people, I really wanted to, uh, be mindful of that. And then I also just didn't feel comfortable filming and all of these people are, you know, in the way. I mean, seriously. Oh, look at the geese. Oh, oh my God. Come on in their little arrow. But it's going to be awesome, guys. It is going to be awesome over here. And I will share more with you as to why I am over here in the first place. But I'm not looking for a townhouse. I will say that much. But these townhouses are absolutely nice. Um, they're a little on the smaller end. But let me tell you something. When I say it a little bit on the smaller end is that if you have a large family, of course, that will not be the route that you would want to take. But if it's just you your significant other and a child then these places will definitely be idea or if you're just single or if you're just junior house whatever it doesn't matter it is a um nice size townhouses for um new families or what have you oh this is amazing oh this is amazing which way did they did they take us this one yeah I'm not the only one over here. Yes, what? Yeah. The snack they gave us for like real, the, like the real classroom. The snack that they gave us was weird. The, the veggie straws, right? Mm -hmm. I could not finish that. I had to take it home. Yes, 
This one is kind of Oh, what about me? Oh, it's Excuse me. Are you all are you all building this home or y'all just looking? Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, this one's three thousand. Um let's actually go in. Okay, well wait a minute. So this is three thousand. If that one's thirty three hundred. This one is I can I, I can be able to tell you right here. All I gotta do is look on this thing. Because I want to be able to see. Because there's only three models, right? So one of these is the model that I'm looking for. Hold on. Then that'll give me an idea. What's attracting all these birds?